Sometimes the human body is on the verge of life and death. When the heart stops fighting, breathing stops, and the brain ceases to receive oxygen. In such moments, a person is included in a state that medicine calls a clinical death. Although the body temporarily loses life functions, consciousness sometimes continues to record events around. And this phenomenon remains one of the most mysterious topics in science and philosophy. Thousands of people around the world describe amazing experiences, bright light, a long tunnel, a sense of lightness and soaring, observing their own body from the side, meeting with dead relatives and a feeling of complete peace. It is amazing that these experiences are repeated in different cultures and religions, which makes them especially intriguing. Scientists offer several explanations. At the time of oxygen starvation, the brain can throw substances, such as endorphins or dimethyltryptamine, which cause bright hallucinations. Other studies indicate chaotic activation of neurons in the last seconds before heart arrest. However, many facts are difficult to explain only biologically. After clinical death, many people were described by the events that took place around their body. The conversations of doctors, the actions of medical personnel, objects in the room, and all this was confirmed by witnesses. How could a person perceive the environment if the brain almost did not function? The AWARE project showed that about 40% surviving clinical death remained awareness. Some scientists believe that consciousness can exist separately from the brain. Philosophers compare the brain with the radio. The signal can exist regardless of the device. Perhaps the brain is only an instrument of manifestation of consciousness, and the very essence of a person does not disappear with the cessation of biological functions. Ancient traditions describe similar phenomena. In the Egyptian Book of the Dead and Tibetan texts, the travels of the soul were recorded through light and meetings with guides. Is this a coincidence, or is humanity the same phenomenon records for millennia? Many who survive the clinical death begin to appreciate life differently. They become kinder, they are less afraid of death, and appreciate every moment. These observations confirm the hypothesis that consciousness can continue to exist even after stopping the brain. Although science does not yet give final answers, more and more data suggests that consciousness is not just a product of neural activity, but more than more. Perhaps death is not the end, but the transition in human consciousness can exist outside the body. Thank you for your attention. These observations remind of the value of life and that our essence can be much wider than it seems at first glance.